88. An 88. Okay. Can I interview you? Is that all right? Sure. What is your name? My name's Ryan. Ryan. Where are you from originally, Ryan? I grew up in uh, Sheriffville, Indiana, just outside of Chicago. Oh, okay. I'm familiar up that way. Um, did a lot of work with, I used to fly, when I was younger, I used to fly in and out of Chicago every yeah. week. <laughs> it was, yeah. It was, Midway or O'Hare? No, O'Hare all the oh, time. Oh. Always been in and out of O'Hare all the time. Yeah. So it's a 1988. Now these things are so popular today. Yeah. So how long have you had it? Almost five years. It'll be five years in uh, in April. Five years in April. Have you had a one before or? I had a 90 for for a well for a while before that that I was going to restore and then all the floor pans were rotted out and I just said you know what time to time to start over. So I found this one. It originally started. It was bought in Stewart. Lived in Stewart for about five years. Then it went up to Ocala. And then it's past 10 years after, you know, of, of its 35, we're in Alabama. So I brought it back down from Alabama. Wow, down gee, here. so it's been around. Yeah. Wow, so it's got, how many miles does it have on it? 112. 112, all right. Yeah, it's got a, a, about 10 on the engine, so it's got a new engine in it. Ah, but look at the condition of it. Yeah, I just had the paint redone and redid all the vinyl. And oh, the you redid all that. Wow, wow, okay. So you had somebody do it? I did a lot of the paint prep. I did all of the, the wood and the trim and everything. You did all that yourself? Yeah. You have a shop or something? Or no? no? Wow. It's so nice to see guys that work on their own cars. The one thing you don't usually see is body work and paint, though. That's true. Most of the guys are mechanical. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, the like paint, I said, I... Paint and body guys you never see out. I stripped all the old stuff off. And, and then they did. They and painted then, it. And then they painted it. Right, so you did the prep work, right? Yeah, but I you know, did all the trim, all that, you know. Yeah, that's well, trim back then too. I know in the Corvairs. Yeah. We we usually just try to leave the trim, <laughs> getting that trim off. It all off. It's oh. Oh, Especially because we have some that curves and it's yeah. oh, it's a pain in the neck. But, yeah, for sure. But wow, to put all this work into this, this is something. Wow. But it's how it was. Yeah. Yeah, the seats are fairly original. A previous owner redid the leather, so the inserts are still the uh, original inserts. I, oh, I, I like that. I source OEM fabric and all that. Oh, wow, yeah. really? So I got about two yards of this OEM fabric. Oh, wow. To put it in. Nice. Yeah, and your seat I see is just, yeah. just greasy and stuff. Yeah. Wow. But I pulled the dash when I had the, when I had the windshield out, I had that recovered and... It's cool because it's it's classic looking yeah. and it doesn't you know like the new one, everything looks the same now you know yeah, so so these were the same body style from 1963 to 1991 right so if you pull up in a 63 I could use the body panels <laughs> off a bit but obviously the interior has evolved but I mean in 1988 this is a thirty thousand dollar vehicle which is equivalent to almost eighty you know seventy wow, thousand yeah million. yeah right so it's got electric everything's electric everything's now. That's a big pain in the ass when you're chasing down electrical gremlins. Oh yeah, for the you know, yeah. You know, nothing's on relays, and so everything's do, you know draws a lot of amps. So I had to rewire a lot of it. I had to <laughs> Boy, you're really into it though. Yeah, so yeah, it's, it's been fun. Did you got? Did you have one in the family growing up that you? No, I just no? It was. I, I mean, I, I'd always wanted to kind of get into cars, and I did my research, and you know, again, we, this was the last carbureted vehicle in North America. So ah, oh, I didn't so, know that. You know. It really was a bridge to the past, past where you could just get a manual, get a wrench, and and figure it out, right? Right. So nothing was until good. after this. <laughs> until after this, right? So this was really the last year that you could just kind of do that. I had a Jeep Cherokee uh, mm. Sport. I don't okay. remember what yeah. year. It was a well, four. Same, same body. It was a four door, but I don't remember what year it was okay. though. I just remember being up in Cherokee with it. Yeah. And pointing to this Cherokee and Cherokee. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> it was, but, you know, I got rid of, you know, by the time by the time that uh, Jeep bought, or, uh, you know, they, by the time Chrysler bought this, right? So this is right. the first year under Chrysler ownership. Okay, in 88. It's such a hodgepodge of parts. I mean, that's a, it's got four steering components. It's got Ford ignition. It's got, you know, the, an AMC engine. So, <laughs> okay, yeah, hodgepodge. There you yeah, go. For sure. But boy, you sure did a nice job with it. Thanks, thanks. But yeah, I got, got rid of the old Ford ignition, or, uh, ignition put, just put an MSD box in. I, I got oh, yeah, okay. on it. Oh, nice, so nice. I got, I got rid of the carburetor. Is it four wheel drive or? It is. It, it is. is, wow. So how does that work? Vacuum switch. Oh, really? Yep. Oh, nice. Just switch and go. Excellent. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. 1988 Jeep Cherokee. Grand Wagoneer, not a Wagoneer, it's a Grand Wagoneer. So a Wagoneer would have had less on it probably, so right? So in 84, I 
think it was 84. Right. Uh, Jeep introduced the, the Wagoner XJ, right? So the XJ, oh. the, so that became the lower model, the XJ. So, so it was an XJ Wagoneer? It was an XJ Wagoneer. Oh, wow. I didn't yeah, know so that. That was their transition from the SJ body. I'll have to, to look XJ at that because I'm not familiar with so that. So they, uh, so that became the Wagoneer and then this became the Grand Wagoneer. And then this, this all the way, all the way through 91, the last year. Excellent. Excellent. Well, great. You did a great job on it. Appreciate it. All right. Beautiful. 1988. He did all the work himself on it, this guy. Beautiful. It is, isn't it? It is nice. Excuse me. <laughs> Grand Wagoneer.